show you the beautiful northeast of Namibia. So, Namibia is beautiful. You will believe me. Let's go. Uh, today it's a beautiful day so as you can see behind me uh, it's bushy it's beautiful um, again the sound of nature the sound the sounds of the birds you know twittering and chirping in the distance and wild pigeons broadcasting that way so we are going to Mahango uh, is a game park so we're going that way to Mahango game park and then I'll show you the beautiful Mahango, different uh, animals. So I'm hoping uh, to get a glimpse of elephants, um, different animals, zebras, and you name them. That's great. Do you hear? Do you hear that wild pigeon broadcasting that way? And I hear another bird, you know, chirping you know, and just twittering up there. So it's a beautiful morning. So I will take you to the game park so we can see. I hope we see the big five. Uh, that's what we're gonna do today so it's in that direction so we're gonna go so join me let's So when you're heading to Mahango, so the first thing that you find here is uh, there's a reception office, a tourist reception as you can see. And then from here, now that is the main gate in, uh, into Mahango, the game park. So if you want to go to the game park, so you can see uh, stop signs over there and that's the main gate. And this is the office. So let's go and just find out what exactly is happening here. So this way you, you do some payment um probably about four i think about five us dollar so this is where you do the payment the giraffe looks strange does not even want to move away so i don't know if it's gonna charge but that's how it looks look how great this massive animal is so striding briskly crossing the road and going that way so that's the life here Looks beautiful and fantastic. Beautiful, there they go, two of them. So you can see the giraffes, one standing by the tree and the other one fading in the distance. Beautiful indeed.
can see there are kudus here but there's something strange apart from the kudus here there's a tree so if you check carefully there's a baobab tree that is nearly cut by the elephants and it's a very frightening tree so it looks spooky this tree is very frightening now you can see now this is what the elephants have done so they have almost snipped this big tree here massively now you can look it up like look on top and then look at the base and then there's that part almost snipped by the elephant so it's a strange tree and then next to it are kudus in the distance so this is very fascinating you have kudu you have a tree being snipped literally in the middle by the elephants now look at the bark trees with the branches over there and the base is wide but look what happens here so elephants come and they always scratch around here eroding away you know the part of the tree the stem of the tree and then there are kurus and beyond that river in the distance such a fascinating area Uh, there's something uh, fast, uh, there's something interesting about this um, zebra so you can see there's a wire around the neck I think it should be helped I don't know but there's a wire so very sad indeed probably it was trapped uh, a trap was set up to catch an animal that's how it survived uh, with the wire around the neck um, so you can literally see let's just take a good view so I can show you this is very interesting now there they are running away and the one with the wire also running away over there it's very fascinating not fascinating but it's a sad situation so you can literally see a wire around the neck now the one looking at me so that one so you can see there's a wire around the neck it should be helped probably was trapped but they just couldn't get it um, what a sad situation. Now look at what the elephants have done. So they have uh, literally destroyed these trees. So this is what elephants do in their natural habitat. So, it's a spring box, but look at what elephants have done. These thorny bushes um, are pushed sideways. Um, and uh, this is all over Mahango Park, so you can see uh, most of these acacia trees are pushed sideways. So it's fantastic. I don't know if it's fantastic that the trees are pushed wayward. Uh, now, let me just show you what elephants have done. Uh, apart from the acacia trees, now you can literally see any thorny tree that I told you now. Look at how this one is smashed literally in the middle. Cuts. 
literally in the middle. Now, there's a bird. So look at the bird. Uh, very interesting indeed. You know, shrugging around, uh, pecking in the feathers. Now, this is what the elephant has done. What a contrasting beauty. The sky looks that way. The tree huffed and the bird shrugs. So it's very beautiful contrast. Now I'm driving on the most dangerous part, so there's a little bit of the bridges here. So for me to get to Mahango, Lo Mahangu Lodge, not Mahango, but Mahangu. So this is what I have to drive through. Uh, look, it looks very da uh, interestingly dangerous and beautiful. Now there's water on the other side, then I have to drive here. And then there's water on the other side. That's how it looks. So I must drive around here. So that's how it looks uh, all the way, small bridges alongside. And then there's a lot of water here, so I'm there. Let's go.
But once you walk here, you gotta be careful of uh, hippos. So they can be hippos sometimes. You gotta watch your steps. You gotta watch what you do. So I I, I hope you can hear the sound of the rapid. You know, uh, running very fast. It's a very fascinating area. So you can hear that. It's quite interesting indeed. So let's get let's go and find out what a uh, popper falls. So here where the, the falls are, but I would rather call them rapid rather than waterfalls. This is massive, so you can see water, this is massive, the mighty Kavango river at its best, this is the famous waterfalls, uh, Papa Falls, you can see the rapid, you don't want to mess with this area, so with the dugout canoe on this area, you will be found dead, now this is the famous Popa Falls. So if you come to the northeast part of Namibia and Africa, this is what exactly what you're gonna see. You hear the sound in the background and down the water smashing the rock. Very fascinating and fantastic indeed. The colors of the water changing because of the rocks. This area is unforgiving. You don't wanna be found caught in this situation. It's very interesting indeed. Look at that. Look at the spectacular beauties of the rocks over there. Look at the water smashing into the rocks. And that's what you get. Very fascinating. Wide and dangerous. Beautiful. All of them. Now listen to the sound of nature. And that's what you get. That's how beautiful it gets. Quite interesting. That side, still Namibia. And over here, still Namibia. Please, thank you for watching and consider to subscribe if, if you are new here. Thank you.